Right, you're right, guys and girls. Welcome back to another video. Right, let's have a look. Uh, so we are just playing the Division Two at the moment. I've just went through some of the stuff. I bought the special edition. I think it was like on sale at the moment for the ultimate edition. I think it was like 50, 49 pounds or something. Normally it's about 60 odd quid, but it's a game from Ubisoft. Um, if you go to apparel, um, I've just unlocked my box caches because you get a cache of different items in there available. Uh, for one week, six days, four hours, uh, legacy apparel, um, caches, and all this kind of stuff. Anyway, so I've just got myself a mask in the box. That's to do with the special edition. It's all random, I believe, so you wouldn't be getting the same stuff as I do, because it'd be all different. And there's my boots, so that one, if I put on there, is just trainers, but you get proper hard-toed cap-toed boots. Um, actually the quality does go up and down so I'm not too sure if they're working on the quality for the internet or if it's to do with my internet but um, I'm actually playing this in high dynamic range at the moment. Okay, so what I'm going to do is run across there in a minute, and on, and on, and on. Right. Oh, right. Take this geezers out here. Right, there we go. Right. And, ooh. Little parcels on there. Because this is supposed to be continued from the original one. Actually, hopefully they put the Division 1 on here. That would be awesome if they had it. Look at that. See, the quality is not... It just seems to be really low. Unless it's because of all high detail. Even though I've got a high internet bandwidth on at the moment. I've got 288 meg. I think it's down on their servers for some reason. Um, I am playing through the web browser as well. Through Google Chrome. Um, so... Oh yeah, you could kick the football as well there. So through Google Chrome. Right, have a look. Apparently, I heard it's supposed to be in 4K through the Google Chrome, but I don't know if that is true or not. The White House is under attack. This is not a drill. Oh, quick Repeat, grenade. This is not a drill. So you press the left um, D-pad button. Come from behind, eh? That's what she you said. Keep your goddamn eyes open. I so the quality just keeps dropping out for some reason. Um, and 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 anyone? Oh. Right, so so I'm recording this in 4K. Right back on. Hey, you got Alright, tell that. You ain't leaving alive. You ain't leaving alive, son. Alright, I fucking pay for that! I'm trying to put the subtitles on them as well. Heading north toward the White House. Looks like they've cut down a group of hyenas and are headed this way. Oh, Agent, geez. if you can hear us on this frequency, keep pushing forward and blindside these bastards. I'm trying to destroy the White House. We gotta get to the White House. All right, here we go. Run, 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 run. All right, let's come on, let's do it. 
as to do with the, the channel. Come on, Dylan. Double tap a row. Ah, okay. Right. Could be dominated. Boom. I've got this geezer over here trying to take me out. Up to dinner. Ouch. Come on. Jesus. Come on. Go, 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 go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come closer. Don't worry, I will come closer. There we go. Contaminated. Boom. Run and gun. Run and gun. There you go. I've just leveled up. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. There we go. Right. Get XP. Right. Right, should we turn it down a little bit on the thing because I don't want any of the music coming in the background because with the volume itself, um, The master volume and stuff. Uh, just put that on about 50. Uh, SFX controls. Uh, do, 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 do. I didn't even know they actually had a photo mode on there. That's pretty cool. All right. My character has like got a mask on everything, but yeah, this is the special, not special. I wouldn't say yeah, ultimate edition because it's already out. Or the DLC, I think you get like year one and two with it, and it was like forty nine pounds, so it's pretty bargain on Google Stadia themselves. Um, actually, this oh my god, look at the White House. So this is the north uh, and the west. So you've got the North and West Base of Operations. You have items in your mailbox. Visit the stash. The stash. Right. Look at the flames here. I mean, when the internet kicks in uh, and all that kind of stuff, and you see the HDR kick in, it's quite nice. It's actually quite something when you get a consistent sort of internet speed to catch up with the what's going on um i might do a live stream tomorrow i'm not too sure yet um but i would have to turn the volume down a little bit while i'm doing it um is that the stash that's the stash um the stash mailbox let's have a look what we've got in here uh 26 grants Ooh. Uh, like level one roofless upgrade blueprint. And uh, what's that? Let me see. Your wall face, Master Gunnery Sergeant Hartman, 
I'm just wondering if I keep these in here, if I can actually, if they will level up once I level up, so I can probably keep these in the mailbox for the time being. Emotes, got a new emote. Comment, uh, comment. What is that actually? Can be used on all Firefly variants. Roman candle can be used on the incinerator turret. Uh, SHD skin and service boots. Agent or t shirt. <laughs> so I can probably equip that. Uh, Agent Ward Scarf. That'll keep him nice and warm in the winter. Uh, got a fire responder helmet as well. What now? Care packages. Oh, you got care packages as well. That's nice. Uh, so I'll keep that in there for now. Some of that. So if I go to uh is that progression uh apparel um care packages or something like that. Can I actually open any of my care packages up? Where do I go from there? Make sure was in here. Ah, okay, so here. So I can go open level one uh backpack level one and fire All right, so what she wants to do then is this one here. Military. So I suppose actually it don't really make much difference with these guns then in here in the mailbox. Um, of grants. So what's this? Ruthless upgrade. So I'll just put in that. Uh, I don't know what else I would actually need. Some pants, maybe. Actually, where's that fire helmet? That looks actually really quite cool. Um, or did I just put that in there? Oh, it says Elite Agent Skin. Head, please. Uh, agent Ward. So, I look at my inventory a minute because I don't want to overflow my inventory with absolute crap. So, if I go here, we have ourselves and a proper orange one which is exotic. So, obviously, that's going to do some serious damage at just level one. Um, we've got uh, what's that one? Uh, three thirteen. I mean, what is this? A machine gun? Uh, rifle. So that's a rifle. So we'll equip that. Then we could probably just upgrade it as we go along. Um, military. What we can do is deconstruct that. And what else we got? Secondary, what can we have for a secondary weapon? Um oh, we've got a shotgun anyway. So this one here. Actually that one. We can get rid of deconstruct that one. Uh, anything for pistol wise? What's better at the two? Uh, 
right, so that one seems to be higher. That's in the green, so we'll just deconstruct that one. And um, ah, backpacks. Is that the backpack? Just uh, backpacks. Have a click that. So, uh, oh, actually, so what's better? Uh, so it seems this one's a lot better. Uncomfortable backpack. Uh, okay, that one then. This one, all these other ones could be sort of deconstructed down. Oh, body armor, actually. That's all equipped already then. Um, like gloves. So everything we've got on us at the moment is usable. Skills, well those are locked at the moment. Got to earn our skill points. Apparel. Ah. Is that the hats? So, ah, that looks nice. So we click on that. Or we could have like a nice uh, high end or superior length. Mm. Yeah, well, we'll put the helmet on. That looks nice. But this one, that we've got that one already. Got the mask on already. Gonna look pretty badass. Alright. You have items in your mailbox visits. That's why I'll do that some later on or something. Um, let's go up here a minute. Killing enemies and opening loot containers can got weapons, gear, and ammo. Check your inventory frequently. Okay. Okay. So we've got to go to this like White House and see what they're doing at the moment. Um, just here. So this guy's playing sort of chess. Is you. A uh, little cowboy. Welcome to DC. Ah, oh, look at the DC do it. I run comms. I'm guessing the divisional alert brought you here. Damn glad to see you. Let me show you exactly how screwed we are. <laughs> Ever since the JT completely screwed, become a playground for murderous fuckheads. There are several main factions and a whole lot of bottom feeders sucking up whatever the big dogs miss. A few civilian settlements are still holding out against all this villainy. They need more help than we've been able to provide, especially since the division network went dark. Um, so the quality go comes and goes a little bit. So it might be on their ends. Operating at the theater settlement on a when's how many people were actually playing on Google Stadia? You should go check in with her. If anyone knows how to get these systems back online, it's her. Oh, and um, introduce yourself to the locals while you're at it. It'll or it could be to, to do with the quality on it. Um, graphical settings what they're using depending head downstairs and check in with the quartermaster he can get you right the quartermaster skill unlocked okay so we need to go to the quartermaster all this hdr i'm playing on at the moment I, i'm actually recording with shadow play so i don't know um if it records in high dynamic range or if you guys and girls, if you're on your computer, if you've got a HDR setting on your PC, turn it on um, in the settings. So you right click your mouse on the main menu or on the desktop, and then just uh, oh, I know what's this, uh, and then just enable HDR with your TV. You should get a better quality settings. And okay, so what to choose skill variant uh, uh, available? Jammer, remotes, so what's this one, this one, oh so you can, uh, what's this one, it's deployed at a set location, continue pulses the nearby area for hostiles, visually highlights them on the target, um, on the agent's hood, um, the 
scanner post surrounding area for hostiles and visually highlights them on agent's HUD. And what's this one? Um, the jammer pulses onwards, overloading and disabling hostiles' electronics. Hmm. Sounds good. Anything that don't give them an edge. Uh, mm, okay. Some more good Take to care. go. The Peter settlement is off to the east. You probably run into some trouble along the way. You'll have to do this. Agent, we've just received a distress call. Uh, we go. York. There's been an attack on the division, and they requested immediate support. All right. On the White House South Lawn. There's a helicopter prep DC is riddled with hostile now? factions which have their main foothold in these three strongholds. Weaken the factions so you can take down their strongholds and restore some order and hope to the city. Theater. Okay, so. Okay. Alright. So we need oh what's this here? New York pilot. Hope you're ready to go to New York. Boots to New York. Embark on a manhunt for Aaron Keener, a downtown man and progress your character from level thirty to forty. Since your agent hasn't reached level thirty or tier five, you can either return to the game and continue playing or choose to transfer right away and boost your character boost. Boosting will automatically complete the level from level 1 to 30 campaign and world tier progression. If you are a new player to the division, we recommend you progress to at least level 30 before transferring. Yeah, well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to leave it for the time being. Uh, get to level 30 by myself. Uh, any means necessary, but not progressing through. I'm going to work my ass off. This is, uh, I mean, obviously, if you're going to get a game, guys and girls, don't just, like, sort of go from level 1 to 30 in a matter of few seconds. Because, I mean, obviously, you're going to need to pick up all your weapons along the way, all your good stuff. Okay, so I'll have to go around the other way. The bloody wrong way, then. Okay, we'll go out this way. Okay. I presume they've got the dark zone on here, or the, the death zone, where uh, the original game was, um, originally. Go out through the gates. White House exclusion zone. Exclusion zone, eh? Let's go for. Oh. Ah, got him. Right, got another one. As you can pick up more these like sort of green stuff, so I'll click as, um collect as much stuff as I can as I go along. Right. What was a little dog there, is it, or was that a deer? Oh wow, look at that. Look at that beautiful, beautifulness. Um, right. Unknown hostiles. Portable device detected. Oh, no, no. This. Right. Unknown hostiles. So they don't know what level they are at the moment. Oh. Loads of people. Is that people in it? Right. Let's go 
over here, set. Right. They're walking down here. Any over there? Fucking so tired. I have to sneak around. Alright, gotcha. Let's have a look at what's going on. Standard. I mean, it's kind of looks nice actually with the reflections in the water. I don't know if they've got it on sort of ultra settings or something like um, PC or maybe on high settings. I mean, obviously it looks nice to, but the quality goes up and down. I'm not trying to shit people now. Just on there. Some loot. Right, uh, anything I can get, like, sort of loot wise, I will have to. Uh, I mean, obviously, guys, it goes, you can see the quality goes up and down while streaming. I haven't had a problem with um, some of the other games, like Grid Racer or, or Grid, I mean, or um, Destiny 2. And they look fantastic. There we go, look, you can see the quality is going upside down. Can I crouch? Oh, I'm gonna put that one there as well. Oh, so it's three. Alright, here we go. 
So I've got to get from uh, the theatre main main campaign that says theatre. So if I can get across there, then we should be good. Um, got to patrol these streets as well, dressed up as a fireman. <laughs> Oh, agent under fire. Virtual, what's that? Virtual triangle. Some graphics are really good actually. When they start working on me. Alright, detected. Alright, and they're almost there. Alright, what's up? I gotta get back to work. Thanks for the movie, Lenny. Anytime, Neil. You coming over for dinner? Not tonight. Gotta meet with some National Guard buddies. They're worried they'll get caught the hell of a quarantine in New York. Okay. We're sorry, but we don't have the resources to accommodate more people. You remember swine flu? Like Everyone freaked out for now. Yes. Yes. In a couple of months, no one will even remember what the dollar flu was. Like Y2K. Y2K. You really know how to make a guy feel old. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. But I don't know. Now, this doesn't feel like it's just going to blow over. People are scared. And you know what happens when people get scared? Nah, you worry too much, Mio. It's kind of weird, guys and girls, as well. All these like uh, games or films made on contagious viruses. I mean, this one is about a virus that actually started spreading out amongst the city. Look, all the whole city on this game is completely dead, and they end up killing half the city. Right, guys and girls, I'm back. So, so yeah, they've got this like sort of contagious um, virus or something that's going around killing loads of people and stuff in this game. And uh, all these other people are like in their own different factions. Uh, Odessa, sorry, at the theatre. So, I've got to find this woman at the theatre. And then I suppose it's someone at the theatre here. Yeah. No, anyway, this is supposed to be in DC. This game, uh, this was actually, I think this brought out last year, or the year before, um, which the game was made. There we go, look. Alright, there we go. That's another um, theatre uh, theater settlement. And actually, I'll tell you what, this is one of the best games, like, to team up and... Um, work together and then go into the dead zone or um, death zone. Um, you do missions together, you rank up your factions, your weapons, your armor, um, and you get better loot, which actually makes it really, really good. Right, let's have a look. Let's go in a second. I mean, look at the Your graphics. Kelso, she just left. I should have gone with her. But I'd only slow her down. Wow. I mean, look at the skin complexion and the whole sort of detail in that face. It's really good. To get to me. And the muscle structure as well. If you can help, I'll be on the your bone debt. density. And I always pay my debts. It's just amazing. Right, new mission. Grand Washington Hotel. Alright, so... 
Actually, right. Let's have a look. Can we quit? Yeah. Oh, right. Anyway, guys and girls, I'm going to finish off this episode here. Could be doing some more later. But if you guys and girls enjoy the episode of this, I'll show some detail in the game and the gameplay and all that. And some of the apparels and clothes and weapons and all that. But this is the ultimate edition. It's around about 50, 49 pound, 50 quid at the moment because it's on sale. Um, if you buy today, I think. I'm not too sure if it's like a buy today or if it's going to be uh, going on for a couple of days because it's uh, Google Stadia. So, um, and this is one of the games coming on to it and it's got cross play on it as well so you can play with other people on pc i hope it comes to console at some point as well um not i mean the game's already out on console but i'm on about the cross play with xbox and playstation needs to happen um and then everybody can sort of play against each other i've been playing modern warfare yesterday with a, a bunch of friends of mine uh doing that war zone um and that's pretty cool um but that's actually cross play between pc xbox and i think playstation as well so i mean it can happen they just need to start working more with other companies and other developers and all that to make it happen anyway it is the 17th of march 2020 it is my birthday today guys and girls i didn't get a cake because i don't want to get a cake for my birthday and all that kind of stuff um because i'm trying to not sort of um put too much weight on uh after i burn a lot of it off i don't want to go back up to where i was before over 20 odd stone so i'm just trying to keep that sort of on the low side but yeah anyway if you enjoyed the episode do like favorite share comment subscribe as always i'm Anth I yeah, you bought me loads of clothes. That would be done on some other videos. But if you enjoy it, cheers for watching, guys and girls. Stay safe. And I'll see you on the next episode. And on, and on, and on.